In this video, I'll explain how to install both Optifine and Forge. And the reason I personally am making this video is because I wanted shaders and world edit. And in order to install shaders, you need Optifine. And for world edit, you need Forge. Now this was a little bit tricky for me at first, but I'll walk you guys through it. First step is to go to the Optifine website. I'll be posting uh, links to everything. However, versions change. I'll be doing 1.14.4. You guys might have 1.15.2 by the time this video's out. The important part is once you're on the downloads page, you have to find versions of Optifine and Forge that match up with each other. And Optifine actually specifies. So let's say I want to try 1.15.2. Right here I see 1.15.2, just what I want. Not compatible with Forge. And this will be at the very bottom of the changelog for each version. And if I, if I click on the changelog for this one specifically, it puts it at the very top. It will see compatible with Forge 28.1.56. I'll keep this in a notepad. And Optifine. So these are the Forge and Optifine versions I want. So now back on the downloads page, I want this one right here. Go ahead and click download. So we can get to our Minecraft folder, which holds our mod folder, by going into the file explorer and typing percent app data percent. Should take you to Minecraft. And so once we're in the Minecraft folder, we can just leave this open for now. Back onto the download. If I hit skip, it'll take me to the download page where I can download the actual jar file. I'll go ahead and save that so that it gets put into my downloads folder on my computer. I'll open up another file explorer right next to this one, right on downloads. So there we go, our Optifine. Now we don't wanna don't wanna do anything here. Next step, we're gonna download Forge. Relatively similar process. So the version we're looking for is 28.1.56. And right here we can select our Minecraft version. We know we're using 1.14.4. And this is not what we're looking for. We're looking for, I know I keep putting it away, 28.1.56. We want to click show all versions and find that in the list right here. Go ahead and download the installer by clicking this button. Skip, save file. So we're going to want to run the forge file right here. This will go ahead and create a profile if we hit install client. Once this is finished, what we need to do is we need to open up Minecraft. Make sure you select Forge from this list. If it's um, on latest release, you want to go ahead and click Forge. And we just want to run it one time. All right, and once we're on the main menu, um, you'll see Forge just to verify that it's working. We can go ahead and close Minecraft. The next step is to add the Optifine mod. So we'll go back to our Minecraft folder, click on the mods folder. And you can copy and paste Optifine in or drag it in. And the next step is to make sure it works. We're done. The Minecraft client opens up all well and good. We hit options, video settings, and you can see all these uh, all these options, namely the shaders. This is the important one. Um, so once we see all these Optifine options, we know that Optifine is in fact working. Thanks for watching.